What's going on everybody? It's Rock with Rock with Modern Survival. I'm back again with another video. Today we are showing the chicken eggs, the uh, Buff Orbingtons. They are on lockdown day. Today is the day 19th and uh, they are on lockdown. So we'll see in a couple days if we have anything. They're pretty heavy. I did not candle them. I just I just didn't want to. I'm just, I, I kind of want the surprise if, to see if anything kind of hatches or not. Um, if you candle them, you can see if there's something in there, and I'm just like, you know what? I want the surprise. I want to see an egg, a chicken pop out the egg. So, that's kind of what I'm waiting for. So, in a couple days, we'll figure out if anything's in there or not. And these girls and boys, or whatever we got, I don't even know what we got, are doing awesome. I propped up their water dish, put a new water dish in their form. As you see, I put the uh, water dish on top of a Tupperware bowl. It's kept a lot of the junk out. Well, that's been a really good thing for them. I went yesterday and I redesigned the uh, heat lamp system for them. So I've got it running from down there, connected up, elbow. This is a half inch pipe is all it is. Another elbow and down, connector, because I just had some spare pieces of pipe so I just connected them. And um, now this works great. This It holds itself in there. It holds, I don't want to have it zip tied or anything. It holds itself by the um, wire itself, and that's all I gotta worry about. It stays in there, does it, the job it needs to do, and if those girls hatch out right there, or guys, whatever we got, then uh, we'll be good to go, right? We'll just throw them over there, and uh, those girls and guys will go out to the chicken coop, and I've, I'm gonna put them in the quail cage, because we actually had no more quail. Um, we lost the quail. They actually escaped from the quail hutch, it's because I left it open on accident and so they jumped out and now the chickens have been using it for a nesting box but I'm going to uh, kind of enclose it a little bit here in the next couple days and put these girls and guys into it and that way they can get adjusted to the new chickens and they won't bother them too much but I'm gonna wait and see if anything hatches out from that and if anything hatches out from that then these guys are gonna get moved and um, I think within the next week, because they should have their adult feathers, they are starting to come in, they should have their adult feathers here soon. So once they get their adult feathers, I'm gonna move them into the new chicken, the old chicken coop, and put them in the quail cage so everyone can get adjusted to everybody. So that's it for today, guys. I just wanna say thanks for stopping by. Hit that like, subscribe, notification bell, and I will see you all in the next video. Oh, and God bless y'all. I'm sorry if I completely forgot to say God bless. Um, it's early in the morning, and it's been one of those mornings already.